Hello there, everybody. Welcome to a brand new Alexa look on Wilmette's Warehouse. This is a, a game by Richard Hoggs and Haggett with music and audio by Ellie Rainsbury and additional programming by Rari O'Sullivan. Start new game and oh, uh, sorry, I got used to reading on the screen. Uh, this is a this is a interesting game uh, that has been on my radar for a hot minute uh, to check out, and luckily enough for me. Uh, game went free on the Epic Games launcher today uh, as part of their their free game deal So I figured why not let's let's take a look at it uh, and see what's going on. It's an organization uh, Game <laughs> I, I don't know how else to word it uh, But I, I think it's gonna be something that's that's right up my alley for a little Alexa look here So let's just get the game going play single player uh, Normal mode sounds good recommended for your first game. That sounds very good. Hello Wilmot Welcome to A5. Is a Wilmot? 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 Wilmot's Warehouse does sound nice. I can't deny my name is okay. I didn't read that. That's fine. You can move with the cursor keys or WASD. Fantastic. We move Wilmot into his little position right there. Fantastic. Also, it appears that my mouse on the screen is not something that I will need, so I, I will just remove it. You can pick up products by moving next to them and clicking them. Okay, you know what? My, my mouse cursor is going to be on the screen. We put the banana in the banana slot. It's, it's that simple, to be honest. Pick up all of them. Okay. Oh, it's a little click and drag action. He's very heavy. He's very heavy. The current limit is six. Says who? <laughs> Says who? I see myself having zero issues getting the, these uh, horseshoes into this, into this thing. It is, look, it's, it's slow, dude. It's, I, I feel like I probably, I probably should not, probably shouldn't do that, right? Let, let, let's, let's move the six like they want me to, uh, and then come back here. We'll grab this one, bring it right back there. Easy money, easy money. Okay. Most products can be organized by a category. Have a go. Okay. Uh, well. Let's, uh. Can I, can I grab these? How about, how about that? Those, those will go in winter. And then, uh, these right here. They're also going to go in winter. But let's, let's maybe organize this in a way that makes logical sense to most, uh, normal human beings. Fantastic. Uh, how about these hats? You want to, you want to give me a little, little hat action right there? There's not nothing screams a good time with some hat action. You know what? Let's let's go even more organized. What's it gonna hurt, right? What's it gonna hurt to be the most organized and also dapper human beings on earth? Just just take a look at at these hats, dude. Okay, how about now? Easy enough. Uh, I'm gonna tell you. Obviously, this is uh, child's hour. If you think that I can't fit these three hats into this thing, oh, they're also winter hats. <laughs> I just realized why they thought that was interesting. Okay. It's your job to give the people what they want. <laughs> I am. Okay. You know what, dude? That was insanely easy. You don't even gotta, you don't even gotta go up to the person. You just gotta go in the general direction. This is, this is simplistic. This is simplistic. My training is complete. Time to start doing it for real. There's a new delivery about to arrive. So, uh, this is our warehouse. Uh, and we have, we have several several spots for things uh this truck comes in and, and we have to make deliveries it's, it's really that simple um organization is going to be key you know it's very important that we stay as organized as possible uh or else we're gonna have a really bad time i also cannot zoom out uh so i can't really see what all we have going on here but let's let's maybe stack things in in nice neat rows where we can kind of uh kind of grab things wherever they they do be be fit so like milk jugs are gonna go right there let's grab uh how about these axes i cannot get the axes out like that though fair enough you can double click groups of blocks to grab all of them that's some great advice juan thank you hey, dude what, what a great tip that's a that's a great tip from juan very very happy about that Juan tip it's a play on words I'm, I'm telling you that it was one tip. Okay, you you get the joke, right? You get the joke. Uh, I don't know how many of each of these we're going to get. So I'm, I'm kind of in a position where it 
It kind of just works. Oh, dude, we can straight up carry different kinds, too. Well, that changes everything. To be, It's a brand new game, to be honest. Here I was thinking that we needed to, uh... You really can't carry all that. Yeah, I was, you was gonna say, you absolutely can carry all that. Oh, and dude, we already have, uh... We already have some of these. Because we got a freaking gem that can go there. How about this? I feel like this was over here. It was over here. No, dude, just sneak that right in there. Dude, we're doing great. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing, though. Uh, which is... I'm not going to say it's a problem, but it, it definitely raises some questions about our, our future here if I don't know what I'm doing. It, it says that the delivery phase, we still have uh, 56 seconds left. Can I, like, read the very important notice? Oh my god. This is a lot of information. This is a lot of information. Um, cl click the clock to finish a shift early. Let's do it. I finished my shift, dude. Okay, now the service hatch is open and my coworkers are waiting for products. You need one crystal. You can see how much time is left in the top left. Do you, do you think I'm blind, dude? Do you think I'm blind? Here, also let me snag this real quick. And, uh, let me snag this real quick, and, uh, frankly, let me snag that real quick. Sneak on up. Happy birthday. You saved everyone with 75 seconds left. I'm the best, okay? I'm the best. We, we have the best setup that you could ever imagine right here. Look at all these stars. You're about to allow me to upgrade myself. I know how games work. Okay, open boxes to see the new products. Okay, we have, we have half of an Owo face. We have poison. We have a paper airplane that hasn't been folded yet. And we have the most valuable product of 2020. <laughs> okay. I mean, you honestly, I couldn't be happier. You can click and drag to arrange them. How interesting. Okay. Uh, well, what's the fun zone, dude? Wow, I really dislike this. Feels like I'm on a drug of sorts. Okay, can we, can we go back to... Yo, dude, the stat screen is so nice. I love me a good stat screen. Okay, get back to work. Get back to work. We got a new delivery coming? Because it sure feels like that should be... Absolutely. So here you go. This is the core gameplay loop of the game. Uh, do, do you think it's the most exciting game in the world? I don't know what you think. Uh, but I'll be honest with you. This is my kind of game. Uh, I love I love games that don't... I mean, I like games that, that try to reinvent the wheel. But I don't like games that try to overcomplicate uh things i enjoy a game that just goes hey you're basically running a factory just organize things and i go you know what i can do that i can do that we now got some soap in the factory it's just it's, it's very satisfying to watch your uh watch your factory kind of get built here right i, I think it's uh, i think it's a unique game so it's also, it's, it's very peaceful, d despite the fact that, you know, we do have a, uh, oh, there's a little, little bit of puzzling that goes on, too. Trying to figure out where the hell, where the hell to, to actually go. I feel like I'm maybe, you know, the organization, it could, it could definitely be better, but. And if I remember correctly, we, we put soap up here. There's a little bit of memory that goes into it, too. Nope, that's poison. Um, <laughs> completely different from soap, to be honest with you. Uh, let's, let's put the soap right here. It gives us enough space to put some more, uh, cassette tapes or whatever the hell those are. Golden rings, I believe I have several. Uh, I have indeed paid attention to the Christmas song before. I will say the, the controls to get the stuff actually placed down is a little janky. Also, dude, the delivery phase is almost over and we are not going to complete it. <laughs> we are not going to complete it in time. Uh, there's like a 0% chance. I think they expect you to move very, very quickly. Uh, and I am, I am not a fast boy when it comes to organization. I want things to look as pretty as possible. This is freaking normal mode, dude, and I'm already losing. That said, you know, there is a, a small chance that Perhaps we uh, actually actually don't need to get all of the deliveries up here by the time the day is over. Or we do. I mean, that's that's also highly likely. So two, Q two sets of Q-tips and a spool. Okay, let's drop that off real quick. 
bring our spool up here. I'm making it where basically it's going to be impossible to get anything out of this in the future, but that's beside the point. These are both new ones, so let's, let's maybe stack some new ones over here. I, I have a second left. The service hatch is open. You know what? I was ready anyway. Two of, two of these, okay? Two of these. Let's deliver those immediately. Two vases, two of these. It, he's actually so good. He's so good. You gave me the ease. I knew exactly where they were immediately. Finish that freaking day early and eat that. All right, new, new products. We got shark fins. We have diamond jewels. We have a return arrow and we have a, a top, top left arrow. Top left arrow. Get back to work. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do a, a little bit of product organization here. And by a little bit of product organization, I mean literally running right down there to get this new supply of goods because, uh, that's a lot, dude. That's a lot of goods. Okay. Let's I just want to get. If you get things in squares, dude, your life is going to be, it's going to be so much better. I'm going to tell you right now. Okay. Grab things that combine into multiple. We got new delivery of milk right here. Beautiful. We got some jewels. Keep in mind, we could technically store uh, different piles for these things. Um, but what, why would we, right? Let's keep everything together for the most part. Um, sure. Six, six stuff. We know that one of those vases goes, you know what, let's, let's begin to do a little wrap around here because we know we got poison right here that we can drop off. Kind of just put that right there, right? Then you grab this and you go, happy birthday. You grab the pokeball and you go, here you go. Uh, hope you catch a Pikachu. And then you run down to the, the pile, run down to the pile. Uh, let's grab Owo faces and rings. We got Owos that we can drop off over here. It's easy, easy enough, right? <laughs> okay, it's gonna require a couple of fixes here in the future, but for right now, we we chillin', we chillin'. Drop them. That's a tight fit to get through there, but you know what? This is actually going surprisingly well. Let's grab all these. We got two two cassette rolls, also called. Uh, I mean, they're not called that in the slightest, to be honest with you. Uh, grab these. How do I, how do I even, I, the soap is too close, dude. The soap is too close. There, yeah, just push it down, push it down. I think, I, I think I've put everything a little bit too close, right? Like, even the, the Owo face, you gotta move a little bit. Let, let's grab, grab this stuff. We can drop off the ring pretty quickly, and then we'll have to make a new, uh, a new pile right here. Honestly, at this point, let's just let's just do that. Can you imagine what this place is going to look like when we have everything in here? That's going to be absurd. Uh, so let's start a new pile for shark teeth. Um, pretty simple, right? It's just you know upside down shark tooth, right? Uh, we already have upside down shark tooth. You know what? Here here's my my new plan. Keep the shark teeth together. Keep the shark teeth together. Looking great. Looking fantastic, to be honest with you. Uh, let's move these over. I just basically, my, my plan is to give us a little bit of space to move. Okay, what do y'all need? You need, I don't have three of those. Never mind, I do, because we had one here. Okay, he's bad. We need these. We also need these. Let's get those delivered. We got reverse arrows, which are over here. And then we also need three jugs of milk. I'm not going to ask what his, his, you know, what he's doing with that much milk. But if it makes him happy and allows him to sleep happily at night, then you know what? Take, take all the milk in the freaking universe, Johnny. Okay, uh, we did it. We should just finish, right? Is now the stock take a chance to buy upgrades? This is, this is what we've been waiting for, to be honest with you. Uh, so rotate blocks. I do. I do think that's good. I do think that's good. Let's buy that upgrade. Increase your carry limit to eight. I think that's also a very valuable upgrade. So now we have two possible things we can get. Um, a quick dash forward or increasing your carry limit to 10. Okay. Okay. 
I think moving faster is, is pretty good. Okay, rotate, rotate. Fantastic. Very happy. Hello, delivery. Just hit me with the truck. <laughs> End my life. End my life. As Wilmot, I would like to go. I would like to go. Okay. Um, paper airplanes. Let's start. Let's start a new new land for the paper airplanes right there. Let's also do. Li oh my god, dude! There's so many paper airplanes. Why so many paper airplanes, brother? This this is too many paper airplanes. Okay. Wow. Okay. No, this is too many freaking spools of thread. Is what this is too many of. Okay, we already do have a place for these, but now that we have a ton of them, let, let's maybe reconsider. My god, dude, we, it, it's just so many. It's actually the most spools of thread. It's, it's not even what it is, to be blunt. Uh, it's so many. It's so many. On the bright side, um, does make our life about as easy as possible here. To just come on in and, and make this look real nice. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna finish this day, damn immediately, right? It's looking good. Do I want to do a little reorg in here? Make sure that things are where we'd like them to be. I think that it's valuable to do a little reorganization of our goods, like this singular piece of wheat right here. I I'm I'm not sure it holds much value for us to be like that. Uh, people better be buying... Oh, this is just not even in the right place. People better buy our damn... Uh, our damn spool of, of cassette tape action and paper airplanes, man. These are the... These are the, the two big sales that we got right now. Let's get these nice and, and reorganized. This is, this, is, this is what's nice, dude. I, I like this part of the game a lot just being able to to organize things make them look good i'm happy we got any important notices it's just the normal it's the normal rules of the game i'm now happy i will end my my take and then we'll get this show on the road oh dude they, they got a lot of things they want though the so three paper airplanes three of these and uh two of these let's get that delivered and then i also need two of these two of these and two of these and let's get these delivered there's definitely there's a little bit of uh spatial awareness that goes into playing this uh there's a little bit of you know obviously there's an organizational thing there's a lot of memory that goes into it as well uh so we we got nuclear bombs <laughs> i'm not gonna say that one to be honest with you uh we got two two penguins kissing and we have ufo <laughs> all right just do not mention, do not mention the one. <laughs> Extremely cursed. Extremely cursed. Okay, hit me with the truck. I want to feel the pain. I want to feel the pain of getting clobbered by the resources. Thank you. You're too sweet. Uh, and we delivered. Dude, these are, these are pretty random. They're pretty random. Uh, let's, let's get, let's get arrows right here. Let's get penguins here. We got some some precious jewels there. This this uh poison, we know it goes top left, but we're going to wait to deliver it cuz we know we have uh some some things that need to be delivered. Shark, yeah, honestly, this is a great time to to just take the poison up cuz you're going to Shark Teeth Alley. You might as well uh you might as well deliver the rest of your goods that go in Shark Teeth Alley. Which are in fact the shark teeth, the shark shark toothery. It's the the spread of meat and cheese, the shark toothery. Okay, let's grab all this. Can I carry all that? Is it even possible to carry all? It is possible to carry all this. Okay, dude, we we got some new stuff in here, and some old stuff. So first of all, drop off your pokeball, then drop off your wheat. Then you come over here and you go, I don't know, drop, drop off that. It's not where it goes though. <laughs> this actually goes right here. I, I, I didn't even remember having axes to be honest with you. Um, UFOs right there. This is, dude, this round is, it's a, 
It's a toughie. I know you're going Tyler. There's nothing tough about this. It's just it's literally just delivering resources to a given area. You're correct. You're absolutely correct. A lot of random crap though. Okay, so we got two vases, two cursed, an explosion, which is uh, easy enough. Explosion's gonna get dropped off there. We also we do have we're we're splitting stuff up all over the place now. We we gotta we gotta get this figured out. Let let's collect you and you because paper airplane obviously goes over here. We know all about that. And then we, we started some arrow collection over here. So let, let's maybe do some arrows there. Let's do the the cursed butt plugs there. And then that's kind of that. You know what? I'm also going to, I'm going to move, I'm going to move these to here. I think that, that having the arrows in the same spot gives me a little bit of direction moving forward for where my stuff could be. I got, I got six seconds. That is not a problem to be honest. Drop that off there. Drop this off here and then this singular q-tip goes right there what do you guys need what do you need you need two rings two axes two pokeballs but i i've now trapped myself in here let's grab your pokeballs also need two of these keeping yourself in a square when you go into this uh, is actually a pretty good strategy. Let's come right up here. We grab two of these, and uh, that should that should go quite well for us. Thank you. Complete. And we're getting hella stars, dude. We're getting hella stars. I think I think we're doing fantastic, to be honest with you. Never felt better. What do we got? We got space invaders. We got another another in the arrow collection. A camera, and the reset also goes in the arrow collection. Okay, it's another delivery phase. I would like to move these a little bit up. We, you got to put the wheat right in front. People people love to see some nice wheat. Hit me with the truck. What do we got? What do we got? A lot of stuff. Splendid work. I'm now stocking 28 of the 200 products. You've added a new motivational poster to the warehouse. Always lift with your legs, not your back. It is it's good. It's good advice. You can't even deny that. Okay. Uh, we drop off this we also have a new arrow we're gonna just drop it off in the middle there we do have a penguin we drop him off axes and vases go in the middle poison goes on the top left there's your poison it is like quite literally wine um it ain't poison but you know what it's gonna be whatever the hell i say it is because <laughs> i'm wilmot and this is my warehouse so if you come to the front desk and you go, hi, sir, I'd like some wine. I'm going to go, uh, pardon me, we only sell poison. Okay, let's... Oh, dude, hitting, hitting control wipes everything. Here I am doing damn Microsoft Word, uh, hold control to select all. And instead the game is like, no, no, no. We hate office here. Okay, I'm, this, this is a terrible setup. <laughs> I'm, I'm learning that really quickly, that this is a terrible setup. Um... We need to do a, a bit more work in this area. This is also just a a lot of random crap, to be honest. Okay, let, let's get this like here. Collect these. Dude, we're we're actually I'm I'm kind of shook right now. Okay, shark fin alley. You know all about it. UFO lane believe yeah exactly right here it's crazy how you actually begin to remember where stuff is over time so shark tooth alley we we do have double soap as well so let let's drop off your soap we'll do shark tooth alley last because we might throw a camera down on that side too uh it is arrow town so get get your arrows here I'm gonna do a little drop off of the arrow there let's let's you know what no we we can I think cameras would be a good thing right next to uh right next to the you know what <laughs> right next to the you know what we'll go right there okay we can't have that much more that we got to put in now a couple of space invaders another camera some gems let's go let's go space invaders here 
You got double arrow action that you can put right here, except now you gotta gotta bring all of this out. Oh, that that's that's some horrific efficiency, to be honest. Camera gets dropped off there. You guys, this is actually good, um, because we're we're set up to do good stuff here. And the gem, I don't even know where it goes. It goes over here. Yeah. Okay, so you guys need soap. Sorry, quarantine. We're out of it. Uh, an axe. And deliver those. We need two shark fins. Two shark fins. A vase. Another vase. And two of these suckers. And if you could give me possibly ones that fit in the best way possible, that would be... That would be some great news. I will say, uh, I'm going to do a little bit of rearranging. Now, we are actually, we should be going into the shop phase thing where we can reorg the place. Yeah, okay. Let's, uh, let's go for carry limit to 10. I do think that that's actually very good. Oh, yo, okay. These are interesting. I like the idea of getting rid of these pillars because that, that opens up a lot of space for us. But uh, here's what I want to do. I, I want to get to a, a point where we can kind of move and have an open lane right down the middle, right? Because in the, in the current way that we're playing, we keep on getting stuck in some areas. So I think that this is kind of the best way to, to handle this. Okay, you're, you're hating me trying to move all of this at once. So let's do it like this. We have a massive UFO collection now. Uh, and I think that this is going to be the space section now. And let's just, let's just get these UFOs down here. This is a lot of UFOs, dude. It's just I'm finding that as we as we move through our warehouse, we are uh, getting stuck on some spaces. And I feel like the best way to prevent that is to just uh, make a big path down the middle and just kind of let let the game come to us. So this is the max we can carry at ten. We are slow, definitely slow. Uh, we know where these go. Cursed alley up here. Got all your essentials right here. <laughs> Cameras and acorns. I think that's a good way to word them. It is quite literal. I believe that is what they are. But come on now. <laughs> come on now. Um. Okay. Oh, I can rotate, dude. I forgot about that. You'd think I wouldn't forget about such a such a useful thing. But here I am completely forgot about the useful thing immediately uh let's do a little bit of cleanup all right a little bit of cleanup just to make sure that things are uh as good as they can be let's move that to the middle nice nice line there let's move this kind of to here a little bit of cleanup just just make squares as many squares as you can make the happier you'll be this is definitely these are close together dude um I want to have the lane down the middle, don't get me wrong, but they're a little close together. I feel like, I, I feel like that's probably fine, right? I feel like it's fine. I feel like this atom bomb we can probably put here instead. Do we got more stuff down here? No, we, we ain't got nothing. Okay, Let, let's do, let's do one more, one more day here. They need three rings, two parakeets uh spaceships spaceships are down here we need two spaceships can i is there any chance that i could pick up some vases uh, you know what just make a delivery make a delivery two vases two shark fin i hate you to be honest i really do because now you're gonna make me make things complicated and then two uh two acorns is easy work easy work this was this was absolutely our worst one um that we've ever had but not too too bad it's not too too bad dude okay uh that's gonna do it 
for this episode of Wilmot's Warehouse. Uh, once again, you can get this for free on the Epic Game Store. A little bit of the, the Dark Knight, the Broken Thumb, the Prince's Crown, and the, the Phallic Rocket. Fantastic. Uh, you can check this out on the Epic Game Store for free right now, or you can pick it up on Steam. I believe it is uh, $14.99 US dollars. But it's fun, dude. Uh, it's, a, it's a very simple game, but uh, it, it definitely has a, a good vibe to it that I really, really enjoy. So if you want to see some more, uh, then let me know, and we can maybe do a couple more episodes. But uh, thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next Alexa look. You have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.